Good day, everybody. And today we're going to talk five things about King George V. Born on June 3rd, 1865, George V was the King of Great Britain between 1910 and 1936. He ascended the throne after the sudden death of his brother Albert. George Frederick Ernest Albert of the House of Saxe Coburg Gotha was the second son of Edward VII and Alexandra of Denmark. He was the grandson of Queen Victoria and Prince Albert. After the death of his brother, George married Princess Mary of Teck, Albert's former fiance, and had six children. On May the 6th, 1910, following the death of his father, Edward VII, George V was crowned as King of Great Britain. George V was the first King of Great Britain from the House of Windsor. With his deteriorating health in 1935, his relationship with his elder son also went awry. Prince Edward, who was expected to be king, failed to do his duties when he had an affair with a married woman. And as always, enjoy the video. Silver Ruffin from Malaysia and today we're going to talk about Straight Settlement 1920-50 cents. Gold and silver got smashed from the Federal Reserve's announcement this week, but it'll be all right. Now, silver at 25.76 USD, gold at 17.63.80 cents. And if you're wondering who he is, he is Data. I'm not even going to pronounce his last name. Um, yeah, known as Goldman in India, he got famous in 2013 when he bought a shirt made with more than three kilos of gold. Let's jump in right into the specifications. Country of origin is straight settlements. Year of production is 1920 to 1921. Composition is 50% silver. Weight is 8.42 grams. Diameter is 28.5 millimeters. Thickness is 1.7 millimeters. Mintage at 3,900,051. Melt value at 14 ringgit 46 cents. On the reverse, we get to see the denomination with beaded circle, date lower right. Lettering straight settlement, 50 cents, half dollar, 1920. On the obverse, we get to see George V uh, facing left and cross on the bottom. Lettering George V and Emperor of India, engraver Edgar Betram McKennell. There are two versions of this half dollar, the 1920. One which has the cross on the bottom like this, and the other one which has a dot, and that is extremely rare, and it's also worth a lot of money. And as always, please subscribe, please subscribe, give me a like, give me a like, and, and share, share the, the video. video.